I'm Sir TapTap -Tap and welcome to Let's Play 10 Second Ninja X. This is a sequel to the original 10 Second Ninja, or sort of a... It's a remastered slash sequel? Yes it is, Parker. Computer, give me a status report. All calibrations are ready. I have completed construction of all the challenges you've requested. The crew are ready and waiting below deck. Excellent. Have you got the target's location? The ship is en route to the target. Estimated arrivals in approximately 30 seconds. The mission is ready to be executed on your command. Do it. Reducing ship altitude to below cloud level. Right, I'll head down and join the crew. Computer? Sir. Love you. Awkward. Okay. <laughs> Very awkward. We have reached the target's destination. Right. Let's see how fast this ninja really is. So, if you missed the original 10 second ninja, which you shouldn't have, it was really good. Um, this is a... I'm not sure if I want to say enhanced remake or sequel, it's sort of both... It contains all the original levels, so uh... You should play this instead of the original one. Um, it's coming out on July 18th for um... It's 10 bucks, but there was a... You already missed it, but there was a launch discount thing where people who played the demo reduced the uh, price of the game by 40%, so it'll be six bucks at launch, actually. Not so fast! If it isn't my old friend, the Guardian of the Forest. Surprised to see me, bobblehead? Rude. There are plenty of surprises to come. Let me give you an example. Surprise! I've kidnapped your forest critter friends. Is this Dr. Robotnik? All of them. It took ages. <laughs> I bet it would. They work for me now. Like so. Bird bots, get that ninja! He is literally Dr. Robotnik. Okay. Let's just beat up these bad nicks and we'll be perfectly fine. End of the game. Oh! We're getting inhaled by Kirby. So, uh, if you couldn't guess, this game is a platform where you have to beat everything in 10 seconds. Welcome aboard my ship, Bobblehead. Good to have you here. Some ground rules. No shoes, no smoking, no ninjas. Now, you've broken at least one of those rules already, so I'm pretty ticked off. You're going to have to get back on my good books. Luckily, I've prepared an array of challenges for you to complete. If you're fast enough on my courses, maybe I'll forget the rule breaking. And if you're really lucky, and you really wish really, really hard, maybe I won't eliminate you and your forest friends. Great beard out. <laughs> Great beard. Um, so, let's... Just go ahead in. As you can see, there's the legacy levels. I guess we have to complete all of the levels. Uh, it says 60 new levels, and then it includes the um, remastered versions of the original levels. So, um, 10 seconds sounds pretty crazy, but uh, really? Actually, I think that's the proper way to do that one. Ugh. Um, actually, the game does a lot of cool stuff to make, um, 10 seconds feels like an eternity in this game. A lot of levels are, you know, a couple of seconds. So yeah, that's how you 3-star that level. Um, a neat thing in this game is how the timer works. As you can see, I've started the level, but I haven't actually moved. The timer starts when you move, which is just brilliant. I... Hmm. Let's rethink that one. There we go. So the game's very twitch reflexy, but um, if we let's try it leisurely here. If you're not good at the game, <clears throat> tech, wow, that was two star. Hmm. Um, <clears throat> if you're not good at the game, um, two seconds or ten seconds is still very doable for most of the levels, um, since you're, you know, the majority of levels you're going to be under five seconds usually. One thing. After you complete the level, it's totally okay to die, by the way. Oops, I actually didn't mean to reset, but, uh... Ah! Close. Nope. So, I really like how f the, uh, resets work, and it's just a button. Uh, just a shoulder button. Um, also... Ah. Uh, not too good at that one. Um, mad props to- oops. What did I do? Um, what I want to do is go to the options menu. Yeah, here we go. Um, so, <clears throat> in addition to controller support, it actually lets you change the button UI prompts from 360, Xbox One, and PlayStation 4. 
I'm actually playing with the PlayStation 4 controller right now, so uh, I prefer those prompts. I actually, um, I'm so used to the PlayStation prompts, I uh, it feels weird to see them. Uh, it feels weird to see the Xbox ones ever, even when I'm using an Xbox controller. I, I just know, like, the, uh, the thing at the top, uh, that is... That's square to me. It doesn't matter if I'm using an Xbox controller. I never think of that as why. It's it's just it's square. So this game gives you a little taste of being a speedrunner. It feels really good once you learn to play this, and it's really not too crazy demanding. Like the to get three stars on all the levels, yes, very hard. How are we gonna get that guy with that? Okay, so I got Parker. Please, please, not now. This is a bad game for you to do this on. Yeah, this is right. Hmm. Ah, that can't possibly be it. Hmm. So. How do I. Parker! Okay. No, not that button. Probably doing this the wrong way entirely. Ah. Hmm. How do I get to that? Oh, I see. Maybe it's not that bad. Eh. Wait, that was three stars? I don't think that should have been three stars. I think that was... I could optimize that last throw a bit there. But, um, yeah, this, this game... Hmm, I could optimize that a bit more, too. Yeah, one second. Um, so this game makes ten seconds feel like an eternity, in, in a good way. And, uh, ah. The resets and the... It's also simple. It, um, I really like N++, but I feel a lot more skilled when playing this game. Because, um, ah. Sorry, he's, he's been here for 10 seconds and my allergies are already acting up. Um, I should have known he would love this game because uh, all of the... Wait, actually. Shurikens go through things, so... Ah. Oof. Ah, no, what? So, um, there we go. Blech. What was I talking about? Yeah, this game lets you feel like a speedrunner without, you know, amazing amounts of practice. You can, of course, actually go for, you know, um, leaderboard, um, you know, go for all stars, go for leaderboards and stuff. Uh, I believe you can see the leaderboards. Uh, there won't be many people on the leaderboard since I'm playing this before release. Uh, just other reviewers. How is that, Ninja? Crying yet? Oh, I'm sorry if my challenges are too tough for you. I thought you were supposed to be Mr. Fast Ninja who could do anything. How embarrassing. How embarrassing for you. You must feel very embarrassed. No wisecracks? Strange. I was expecting some back chat. I even wrote some devastating comebacks for the occasion. You'd say something like, I'll beat you, Captain Greatbeard. And I'd be like, I'll literally beat you to death. Okay, maybe a little too strong. I'm secure enough to admit that. I'll always make it work in the sh I'll make it, it'll, well, I'll make sure it'll work in the moment. I just need you to lash out first. And you will, that's for sure. Oh, you will. Not only that, but... Oh. Guess we're going on deck. I do definitely recommend a controller and a uh, D-pad for this game. Um, that's why I'm using my... Oh, what are you? That is why I'm using my PlayStation 4 controller instead of my uh, Xbox One controller. Even the Xbox One Elite controller, not a fan of the D-pad. You got one out of nine. Is that a CD? Not actually sure what that is. Yeah, the visuals look really nice. Um, this get, did I mention this is for, I'm playing on PC, but this is also coming to PS4 and Xbox One. I believe those are all same day. Captain probably doesn't want me talking to you. Bah, that's no fun. I'm Cat. Pleased to meet ya. I'm in charge of recreation here. Gotta try to keep things light. 
I'll show you what I mean, but the power went out. We've got a backup generator, so don't worry much. But if the engine stopped working, then you could start screaming. It'd be helpful if you gave Benji a visit, though. He works in the generator room. We'll have you back in no time. I'm locked out until it's working again. Give me a visit when the generator's back online. I know a bunch of tricks you can use. Don't call Greatbeard, hee <laughs> hee. So apparently we've got some exploration-y elements here. Whee! Hey, home sweet home. Oh, maybe not. Stop right there. You're trying to leave, maybe. That is so rude. I can't believe you right now. I had so much more planned. I'd appreciate it if you respected that. If you could just be bothered. If you're coming back to the ship with me, you are going to do this properly. Unbelievable. Oh, I can't hurt him. So yeah, I guess no escapes for us. Man. Oh, in the original game, they, they were robot Nazis. Um, that's a bit hard to do with, you know, consoles. It's probably more like, um, I don't know if you get a higher rating for that, but uh, it's a bit more console and localization friendly to not have robot Nazis, I guess. So uh, now we just have bad nicks. Whoa, you're that ninja, right? The one the captain kidnapped? I've been dying to meet you. The way you move, the way you fight. Uh-oh, he's coming on to me. You're amazing. I'm Benji. Ship maintenance. You're probably here because the generator went down. Sorry, we got it from a crumbly supplier. They couldn't make something stable if their lives depended on it. I'll get it fixed in no time. Oh, you did get it fixed in no time. <laughs> That's the developer stamp of quality on the faulty generator. Got a little... Oh. Secret! Secret area discovered! B plus N. Oh! He, he is my secret creepy admirer. I'll just take that piece of a CD. So apparently we've got a bunch of stuff to collect. In addition to our stars. What the? Why, why did I spawn over here? Whatever. Alright, so the power's back on, I guess. I'm not sure why that happened. Great Beard Arcade! Let's, let's play some arcade games! Ah! Uh. Oh, hello! Welcome to the Great Beard Arcade! Currently we have, uh, one game. I call it Cat's Crate Smash, after yours truly. It's pretty fun, I'm not gonna lie. If you do well enough at it, I'll give you a hint token. If you ask me, some of the captain's courses are too tough for their own good. Keep that between us. Let's give it a try! Oh, so we can play a minigame to get some hints. That's, that's cool. Oh, we unlock more game? Oh, no, this is the game. Oh, I was supposed to be looking for a thing. I wasn't... Okay, I get how it works. Oh. Erase from history. I remember it, though. In fact, a little while ago, I trapped down a copy of the sequel the developers were looking for before they were all killed under suspicious circumstances. Unfortunately, before I got a chance to play it, Captain broke the disc. I don't think he did it on purpose. He was just being clumsy. All the same, I think he's trying to hide the evidence. I found a chunk of the disc the other day. There are probably more lying around. If you see any... I'd really appreciate you picking them up. You can take the piece I found with you. It's on the shelf behind me. Do come back if you find anything else. You want more tokens, Parker. Don't sit on the keyboard. Um, so yeah, she just told- I accidentally skipped- I knew it would happen as soon as Parker got here. Ow! Hey! Get out of here. Alright. Can we play that game one more time? No? Oh, come on. Yes. Okay. I get how it works now. I don't actually need a hint, but uh, I just want to succeed in this game once to see what happens. Oh! We get multiple hints! Oh, that's neat. There were no hints in the original game. Uh, come back, I need more, some more tokens. Huh. So that's neat. I, uh, oh! A review copy of this game was provided by the developer. I'd probably just slap a little notification about that at the beginning of the video. But, uh, yeah. I, uh, well, I'm playing it before release, so that should be pretty obvious. But, uh, I still always try to disclose my stuff. Unlike certain YouTubers and certain, um, Counter-Strike Go lottery operators. So, oh, so you're the guy. Hmm. Move along. I'm not looking to make friends. 
Marathon mode. Ah, yeah, that's probably the uh, costume department. Hey! Why, hello. I'm Natalie. Welcome to the wardrobe department. Technically, I'm not supposed to talk to you. I don't think I can resist, though. We've heard all so much about you. Can you say one of the classic quips I've heard so much about? Huh. Captain never said you're the quiet type. Ah, oh, well, I hope you like what I've done the place. Get a few different costumes between me. Before we tried the... Before the... We tried before Greybeard settled on the captain thing. Feel free to have a look around. I'll let you try them on. I don't think that's gonna happen while the captain's here. Oh, so we have to beat the game. Oh! Secret. I guess you have to beat the game to get new costumes and stuff. Oh! Oh my! That's a bit saucy for the kids, don't you think? Let's just pretend we didn't see any of that. Oh my. Oop. Wait. Why did I? Oh, hi. Uh, it's not what it looks like. The captain knows I have that. He's a bit of an expositionist. <laughs> I find it kind of cute. He doesn't believe me, though. No matter how many times I tell him. I know you're not the talkative type, but please don't tell him you saw this. I'm sure it's not news to you that he's... Well, he's not the most secure person. I hate for him to feel bad about this. Why did I spawn... I swear I spawned at the other side of that tunnel, so I didn't actually see her to talk to her. Yeah, marathon mode is... I think it's the whole game? Like, you play it, you know, well, marathon style. And you just play one level after another, and you only get so much time to complete it. At least that's the way it was the first time. Oh yeah, here's the, um... Here's that good old leaderboard. That's real nice and fast fetching, too. Game design Dan, I, I kind of figured he would be at the top of most of the leaderboards. That is the creator of this and the original, um... <laughs> mates. I don't have any friends that have this unreleased game. Not sure how that happened, but... Uh, oop! Got electric ones now. Um, um, what was I talking about? But yeah, mar did I mention marathon mode? Yeah, marathon mode, you just play the whole game in one session, and you get... This, I think you get like 10 minutes in the original game. I'm not sure exactly how it works in this one. Since it's, you know new game and all that this is my uh, I played a little bit just to get back in the hang of things but uh, from now on this is pretty much this is all new territory hang on all right so there you go just getting started so the original games already unseen I forget how much it costs but I mean just get this one basically this I think this contains all the original levels, it's only six bucks, and um, the visuals are improved and everything. By the way, this is a uh, Game Maker game, um, so Game Maker games are not as bad as you might think. They get they get a bad rap, what the? Oh man, yeah, I guess you gotta be pretty precise. There you go. Um, game Maker games are totally capable of running at 60 frames per second. Um, Oh, you get to unlock hint. I see how the hint system works. I... Ah, ah whatever. Whatever. Doesn't matter. Huh? Okay, I see. Ah, oh, that was bad. Okay, I see the. Yeah, there's usually a very specific um, path you're supposed to take to get uh, some of the more picky things in this game. Oh, there we go. That works. Some of the more picky uh, three stars. Um, when I talk about this game like I know it, it's because I played the original. I, um... Interesting. Hmm. Doesn't feel right. It doesn't feel right at all. But um, 
in case it's not completely evident, um, the feel of this game is really good. Real, um, <sighs> mistakes do not feel too punishing at all. Oh, I see. Uh, you get a real f good feel of, oops. You know, when you, when you do well, it feels good, and when you don't do well, it really doesn't waste too much time, and you just keep going. Um, Wait. Oh, I see. New levels do not take too long to figure out, as you can see. I Almost all these levels are new to me. Ah. And uh, at least to get uh, one or two stars. Dang it. Um, doesn't take too many tries to uh, figure out at least sort of what you're supposed to do. There we go. Ah, not too great. Um, did I do a full Let's Play of the original one? Okay. I'll probably do, go and do a full, wait, how do I get, how do I, oh, no, a normal shot should work. Oh, I need to save up my shuriken. You only get three shuriken, no matter which level. So you gotta optimize. I love that the, the rules stay consistent, so, um, it really helps in knowing what to do to approach new levels. Three seconds? Had to oh, no, I did really bad on that one. It's very hard to actually. Let's let's see what how long it takes to get to ten seconds. What? Never mind. Ten seconds is always ten seconds, but ten seconds is a lot of time in these levels. Like none of these. Well, there's a few that are a little cramped, but generally speaking, you're not gonna running out of time isn't gonna be a realistic fear. Anyway, we beat this level, so uh, oh. We are exactly one star off. Wait, I didn't complete this level? That's weird. How did that happen? Ah, oh, that was bad. Okay. And your your katana reaches pretty dang far. So there we go. New area unlocked. Aw oh, man, that was pretty close. You're gonna see a lot of, you know, fractions of a second that you missed by... Uh, there was a trophy in the original one for um, getting off by 0 .01. That's... that doesn't feel good, but at least you get an achievement. Bubblehead! So sorry, got cut off last time I spoke. Benji, you buffoon. What's going on down there? Sorry, sir. This generator ain't the best. You're not the best, Benji. I've got half a mind to throw you overboard. Hearing you loud and clear, sir. I won't let it happen again. Good. Now, Ninja, where were we? Oh yes, you were about to tell me that you give up. Something like, you're right, Great Beard. I'm not great as people think. Or I'm a fraud. No one can be as fast as I pretend I am. You're prepared. You've prepared something. So go on. You can actually talk, right? You understand what I'm saying? Oh boy, this wasn't what I was expecting. You know what? Fine. You want to play it like this? We can play it like this. The gloves are coming off. I'm going to make you talk whether you want it or not. No more Mr. Nice Beard. I mean, my beard is still nice, but up. Oh. Generator's dead. Benji! You're doing this just to see my beautiful face, aren't you? Oh, yeah, you're back. Sorry that you had to see that stuff a second ago. Great Beard's a bit great big meanie. I only put it up with him because it's easier than being on his bad side. I'll get the power back on in a jiffy. Well, hey, can I come with you? Captains always need to take down a bank. I was too scared to confront him. But with a friend like you, even Greatbeard can not even Greatbeard can stop us. So what do you say? <laughs> Ten second ninja and Benji! Yay! Come on, buddy, let's go! What? He's actually coming? Double jump to reach high places! I, I, Benji, I don't think this is gonna work out. You know what, whatever. I'm, I'm just gonna pretend he's not there. Try throwing shurikens at faraway enemies! Oh man, he's Omo Chow! Oops. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Rest in peace. <laughs> Poor Benji. Oh, he's still dead. I can't feel that bad now. Poor Benji. <laughs> okay. Well. I think things didn't work out with Benji. Oh, we got mechanics now. 
I wanted to stop after that level, but, or after two areas, but uh, <laughs> the Benji thing is worth it. So did, did the title screen go back to normal now? <laughs> Poor Benji. I, I want to see if Benji's like dead forever or you know, just like severely wounded. Oh, no, he's dead. Rest in peace, Benji. Your sacrifice will uh, not be forgotten. <laughs> Poor Benji. 